Hi, I'm Dr. Anjali Marte, consultant dermatologist. One of the things I notice is that there seems to be a lot of confusion about vitamin A containing compounds in skincare. When we talk about vitamin A in skincare, what we're referring to is a group of compounds known as retinoids. Of that umbrella term of compounds known as retinoids, there are derivatives such as both retinol and retinaldehyde, or retinal for short. Whilst both retinol and retinal will have anti-aging benefits, retinal will get you there faster because it's stronger and it's quicker to act within the skin. One of the additional benefits that you will notice from using retinal over retinol is that it also has anti-blemish or antibacterial activity, so may be suitable for oily or blemish prone skin. Retinaldehyde is notoriously difficult to stabilize. If it's not stabilized, it's not going to do anything for your skin. The formulators at Medicaid though seem to have cracked it. Crystal Retinal contains a double layered stabilization system. It combines an ingenious crystal encapsulation alongside a patent pending stabilization complex to maximize retinaldehyde stability whilst reducing sensitivity. Crystal Retinal comes in five different strengths. It's a stabilized retinaldehyde, so there is something for everyone. Crystal Retinal 1, which corresponds to 0.01% retinaldehyde. Crystal Retinal 3, which corresponds to 0.03%. Crystal Retinal 6, which is 0.06%. Crystal Retinal 10, which is 0.1% retinaldehyde. And then the new professional only Crystal Retinal 20, which is 0.2%. All of the strengths of retinaldehyde can work to resurface and renew the skin texture, as well as provide anti-aging benefits such as improving fine lines and wrinkles. Think of it as a ladder approach. Your skin needs to be able to get used to the lower strengths and build up tolerability before you move up to the next corresponding higher strength product. By doing things in this way, what you will do is reduce the risk of any irritation, sensitivity, dryness or flaking because your skin will get a chance to acclimatize. Crystal Retinal 20 is the newest addition to the Crystal Retinal family. It's formulated with 0.2% retinaldehyde to make it the most powerful Crystal Retinal that we have to date. It's there to deliver next level results. Because of its strength and its formulation, Crystal Retinal 20 is only going to be available through professional channels. It is extremely important that you speak to a trained health professional in skincare before you use this product to make sure you do not have any problems and you have appropriately worked your way through the other strengths to reduce any chances of irritation or sensitivity. When we're talking about the basics of a good anti-aging routine, it is important to pair together the right ingredients. In a nutshell, the fundamentals are that in the morning, you're trying to protect your skin from all of the environmental aggressors it faces during the day. At night, the idea is to allow for repair and regeneration whilst you sleep. So a good example of a morning skincare routine would use a vitamin C serum, such as C-Tetra Intense, which functions as an antioxidant. Antioxidants can limit damage by free radicals, these harmful molecules that are found in ultraviolet light, the environment, in pollution, all of which have the ability to damage our skin cells. An antioxidant serum should be followed up with a good broad spectrum sunscreen. So ideally a sunscreen which has protection against both UVA and UVB and is a minimum of a factor 30. At night time, it is important to use a vitamin A based product such as a crystal retinal of your preferred strength. 
The vitamin A will help to resurface and renew the skin, as well as boost collagen to help with anti-aging such as fine lines and wrinkles. Essentially, using vitamin C, vitamin A and sunscreen are the absolute fundamentals of your basic long-term anti-aging skincare routine.